wear your fucking masks. Given people still don't wear their fucking masks, absolute shit. We need government to step in. I didn't, I didn't say that. Fucked up, I've never said it. I live it, I put diamonds on my sheets. Fucking with the sound, they got lemon or beef. Shout out double low and shout out when they wake up. And I talked about this on Twitter. Forty-four billion dollars? Are you fucking kidding me? He has forty-four billion fucking dollars to spend on his fucking ego? That is an utterly obscene amount of money. It is an obscene amount of money. No, 44 billion, Dana, Dana, 44. And like, yeah, and like the amount of good, like a billion dollars is beyond our comprehension. The sheer amount of good that he could do with that amount of money, and he spent it on that shitty fucking bird app? Like, nobody nobody even actually enjoys being on Twitter. <laughs> it's the weird thing. Nobody actually likes being on there. It's just, it's better than any of the alternatives uh, social media. So, like, so much good that he could do, and he's chosen not to. He's choosing not to do good at this point. Like, not too long ago, he was talking about, oh, if you can provide a plan for how I can use $5 billion to solve world hunger, I'll do it. And, like, the World Bank provided him, I think it was the World Bank, provided him a plan. No, 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 James, Elon, e what Elon did is, uh, and this is what I was just talking about, Elon said, hey, if you can provide me a plan for how to solve world hunger, I'll pay for it. He was provided a plan. He just never fucking did anything. Like, he didn't bother. Like, he used all, like, here's how you can use your money to solve world hunger. And he just never fucking replied to it. It's just... The guy is just fucking awful. Julie Witcher, yeah, yes, yesterday was a hard day at work, uh... Jilly, you know, you know that I, I worked so hard yesterday. Bile, I'm not gay. People have, I've had a couple of people call me out on that on Twitter, and uh, yeah, so I apologize. Um, I apologize for using AIDS as a as a punchline like that. So for those who aren't aware, uh, on Chantel's uh, stream briefly, uh, on Chantel's stream last night, very briefly, uh, somebody asked me what I thought about Jared Fogle. And, uh, and, and like, I remembered, and I was remembering that episode of uh, South Park. Uh, Ugly Hobo, thank you very much. You and Darkside Phil need to collab sometime. Why is Elon Musk uh, obliged to get us done his mic? With great power comes great, there must also come great responsibility. This ain't fucking complicated. Like, honestly, like, oh, why should Elon Musk spend his money to help people? Because helping people is a good moral thing to do. You don't do it. I also don't have a billion fucking dollars, dude. Like, I don't, like, I'm fucking broke. Sure, yeah, I should do more to help people. I'll admit that. But I'm not a fucking billionaire. Like, it's just... Well, why don't you spend a billion dollars to help people? Like, what the fuck? Guys, come on. Fuck off. You can't force someone to do something? Yeah, and the fact that he intentionally chooses to be a selfish prick. Knock off the fucking... Kitsune, if you tweet that... If you post that comment one more time, I'm actually going to just fucking block you, because I fucking hate spammers. You're spamming, and that just pisses me off, kids, and I so fuck off with your spamming. Who loves orange soda? Kel loves orange soda. 
And that by saying the N word more, we take away its power? No. I do not think that, no. Yeah, I really need to get down to, uh, I need to get down to a Service Ontario office to, uh, to update my ID. Leisure Suit Larry. Yeah. I played the original Leisure Suit Larry in the Land of the Land Lizards. On fucking floppy! I played Larry C. I played I played Leisure Suit Larry on fucking floppies. Would I ever fight Ethan Ralph? No, I don't want to fight. I don't like fighting. I'm a coward. I'm a coward and a weakling. Jeez, Ray. Yes, I am lazy. I will get around to it. Like I'll admit, I'm. I've got an absolute ableist side to me. I'm not gonna lie. There's a lot of dis abilities where I would be uncomfortable dating a woman who had uh, who had one of those disabilities. It's wrong of me. I'm not proud of the fact that I have those added those uh, hangups. I'm not proud of those hangups. I sh it's something that I should work to get over. But it's ha but they're hangups that I have, and it is. They are ableist hangups. So, yeah, it's. If somebody isn't able to date a trans person because of uh, personal hangups, it sucks, but whatever, it's fine. They're not a bad person. If they're just saying, no, trans women aren't women, I'm not going to date a trans woman. No, they're not a woman, I only date women. You're a fucking transphobe. Being proud of not. Being willing to date a trans person is transphobic. Like, there's just no getting around the fact that if you are proud that you refuse to date a trans person, then you are transphobic. Because being proud of rejecting trans people, you're a dick. You're just a douche. Anyway. I was asked my opinion, I gave my opinion, so all of you trying to get pissed off me for, for my opinion, yeah, feel free to fuck off and stop watching me, you transphobic dickwads. This is a slur. No, it's not, you fucking dumbass. Because, like, it's not that I want everyone to be poor like me, it's that, like, the whole point of Christianity, like, literally the whole fucking point, the thesis that it was founded on is like, give up your wealth to help people. Easier for a camel to get through the eye of a needle than for a rich man to get into heaven. Like, and then they like, oh, eye of the needle is a fucking giant fucking massive ass date in the city. No, it's like fucking, God. Jesus actually said that rich people don't get into heavens, or don't get into heaven, and now there's these fucking preachers out there like, oh, no, no, God loves rich people. Wealth is how you know that God loves them. It's like, fucking hell. It's just this utterly asinine bullshit. Some rich people give everything they have to charity when they die. Yeah, and most of them, most of them leave their money to their kids. I'm so fresh, you can suck my nuts. I'm so fresh, you can suck my nuts. Swag. I'm so fresh, you can suck my nuts. I'm so fresh, you 